Well, the invention that made all those pictures spin around like that is called Quantel, and it's British and has been in use now for 18 months. But now an even more unusual electronic gadget has been devised by some engineers right here in the BBC. We're giving it its very first public showing, and at first glance it looks like something from Doctor Who. But this machine can actually memorise a television picture and then change its size and position and put it anywhere it wants to on the television screen. And a few minutes ago, it actually memorised that customised bar stool and bike that we showed. And John Mitchell's very kindly come along to give us its first public demonstration. John, welcome to Blue Peter. You're one of the inventors of this machine. So perhaps you wouldn't mind demonstrating it now. Well, around the outside, we have the pictures of the bar stool and bike. And I've put a picture of ourselves in the middle. Um, we can uh, do a few more exciting things. Oh, that's beautiful. Well, we call that our bow tie. <laughs> uh, let's try something else. Oh, the checkerboard. Or even, uh, what's this? Just a few stills with one moving picture. Oh, that's quite lovely. Can you explain how the machine works very simply? Because I'm certainly not electronically minded. Well, there's, there's a lot of computer memory, and it's, you can think of it like an electronic blackboard. Mm. Um, we take the television pictures and squeeze them and put them on the blackboard, on the screen, wherever we choose. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and does, does this involve a yes. sort of, what's it, silicon chip, isn't it? Yes, it's got a microprocessor in it to keep the whole thing under control. And how many of those are there in the machine? There are hundreds in the machine, um, some smaller than that. Mm -hmm. About a 50 is the memory for the television picture. Yeah. There's only one, which is the microcomputer, yeah. and another dozen which hold the program for the microprocessor. So computer. presumably somebody has to feed all the information into the program, yes, as it indeed. were. Do you have to do that? Yes, yes. What, what's I that? I have a, a list of instructions which have been fed into this one. Uh, hmm? It goes on for many more yards. This must have taken you hours. Uh, months, really. And you, you kind of thought, right, you know, I'd like a picture with a moving bit there and three stills, and then you, you sorted that out, did you? They grow. And when you think of new ones. Gosh, I think that's amazingly clever. Can you demonstrate some more magic tricks? Yes, if uh, Simon would like to take Goldie for a, a run, I'll put this tape of effects in and we'll see what we can do to the camera pictures. Right. Goldie's going to demonstrate her talents as a footballer now. Oh, <laughs> fine, have a good scratch. <laughs> and now, now the machine is sort of memorising the picture, is it? Well, I'm sorry the tape was a bit slow. Um, it's, it's off any moment now, I think. Right. Oh, that's the roll. Oh, that's gorgeous. It's gone on strike. It's uh, <laughs> working well. We've got three pictures now. Yeah. Uh, four different sizes. Four goldies, what a thought. Yeah. <laughs> roll him around. Oh, that's a nice one. And a quad. Let's put one in the middle. So you've got how many stills around there? Four that's stills one, two, around four and stills. one in the middle. And a moving Zip around goldie. the outside. That's a good one. Oh, I like that. Oh, that's lovely. And many different sizes here. It's a great toy, isn't it? It'd be wonderful to have great it at fun. home, actually. Oh, look, there's the bow tie Last again. Last of all, the bow tie again, yes. John, many congratulations, and I can only wish you... Thanks a lot, Simon, for being Just, our, uh, uh, our TV well. demonstrator. And many, many, you know, all the best for the future. Thank, Thank you. <laughs> and from that mind-boggling new invention to this mouth-watering new book because next Friday marks a long-awaited publication of the Blue Peter Book of Gorgeous Grub.